Yeah people, welcome back to another video. In this video, I am going to show you how to make Jamaican salt mackerel with aki. Are you ready? Alright, before the video starts, just click that subscribe button, click the notification bell, and just remember at the end of this video, like the video. Yeah, no. So the first thing we're going to do is, or the first thing you're going to do, is boil your salt mackerel. This has a lot of salt. So what you're going to do, you're going to put it in some water and you're going to boil it for about 30 minutes. After it's boiled, you're going to go through and you're going to clean it. You're going to take the skin off and you're going to spend your time to debone it because when you eat it, you don't want any bone to be stuck in your throat very very dangerous you're gonna go through you're gonna clean it very very carefully all right I'm going to leave the middle bone in there because what I'm a Jamaican <laughs> Slow down, slow down. What me say? Very, very carefully. Debone it. Get out every bone that you can find. Right? You don't want to eat this and you have a bone stuck in your mouth. Or your kids to eat this and they swallow a bone. Back to it. breaking it up going through it looking through it taking out all the bones that I missed yeah it's always nice to double check so now we're gonna prepare our veggies we have scallion tomato sweet pepper and thyme also garlic can't forget the garlic all right, so we're gonna chop these up and then we'll get right back. Hot, hot, hot. We're gonna stir fry all these veggies. I'm gonna add some oil. Make sure your oil is well hot. I'm gonna stir fry these veggies. And you know, when I'm making this, 
I don't like I don't like my veggies too soft why the aki is already soft so you can't have your veggie soft and then your aki soft and then all you eat is mush 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 something have to be crunchy to balance out the softness of the aki so you're gonna stir fry this up no no kind of salt is added the the fish is already salted so you don't really need to add any salt to this all right and make everything fry up you're gonna add in your salt mackerel add your salt mackerel in fry it up with the vegetables for another five minutes after you fry it up for another five minutes and you see that the vegetable is halfway cooked then you're gonna add in your aki So after you add in your aki, you want to add some taste. You want to add a little bit of black pepper. Not too much. You don't want to overpower the dish. A little bit of black pepper. A little bit of adobo I add in. Remember, no salt. And then we're not going to stir. No stirring. We're going to use a folded method. Because if you stir, what are you going to have? You're just going to have scrambled eggs. So you cannot stir aki, just do the folding method. Out to in, just fold it. Right? And you see the aki is soft, so I'm trying to be really, really gentle. Now, we're going to cover this up and let it simmer for about five minutes. We're gonna uncover it. We're gonna add the tomatoes. The reason why I add my tomatoes in this time right now is because I don't like my tomatoes to be soft in aki. I like to taste the tomato because you know when you cook your tomato it gets soft and when you it's time to eat you really don't taste nothing. So when you add them in right now, you still can see my for another 10 minutes and taste the tomato once everything is complete add a little bit of water get a little bit of moisture in there see it there now all done simple and easy 30 minutes time cooking, 30 minutes everything done, breakfast done. Fold it up one more time. How nice that look. Yeah man, everything done. Gonna plate it up. Look at that. Nice. So for breakfast, I'm gonna serve this with some fried dumpling. And you know, it's best with the fried dumpling. Plate this up and enjoy. Mm -hmm.